Hello everyone, welcome again. Now in this video we are going to discuss how Ant works. So whenever you build a project, you require a lot of configuration. For example, creating the folder structure, copying the jar into the respective folder, setting up the class path, etc. So this all configuration can be done with the help of Ant in one shot. For this, Ant will rely on a file called build.xml. So I have added one build.xml in my test ng project. Make sure that this build.xml should be parallel to your SRC folder. Now this is how the plain build.xml look, which have a project name as testng and default test. We are, we are going to talk about this default attribute at the later point of video. Now inside the build.xml, I need to the create, sorry, I need to create targets. The target are the sequence of the step which is which Ant is going to execute. So if you look at our project, we have bin folder, source folder. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create one more folder inside that uh, a project that is lift folder and I'm going to place all the jar inside the lift lift folder with the help of ant so let me create the first target let me call it as a clean which is going to delete the lift folder if it is already there so for that I'm going to take the help of delete inside that I'm going to specify the name of folder <coughs> 